Welcome aboard the Archimedes, a ship for voyage address. Hello, I'd like to welcome you aboard the Archimedes today. My name is Carter Quillen. I'm a registered professional engineer and an amateur environmental activist. The Archimedes is the world's largest solar-powered concrete boat. At 50 feet long and 14 feet wide, it displaces 20 tons and can go five miles an hour on nothing but sunshine. When I bought this boat, it had wooden rigging on it and it was 30 years old and it was all deteriorated so I had to do something with the rigging and I was going to re-rig it but then I got this idea for the electric boat and I was just like ah, that seems like a good idea and let's try it <laughs> and here we are cruising on the river we're only going about two and a half three miles an hour but we're going there on nothing but sunshine we don't need no stinking fuel <laughs> built the ARC to be a demonstration platform of sustainable energy and sustainable living. We have, when we're done, when we're completed with the boat, right now we're still under construction, we'll have five kilowatts of solar that will operate our propulsion system and give us up to five miles an hour in full sun, you know, just from the solar. Uh, we have a solar powered air conditioning system on board as part of our um, off-grid system, built micro-power systems you know, for my RVs and whatnot, and, and the really exciting thing right now is that the cost of all this stuff has come down so much in the last couple of years, and people don't realize that you can buy your own, you can have your own power plant for your home for less than the cost of a mid-sized car. For our maiden voyage, we plan to, to sail or motor electrically from Jacksonville to Pensacola and conduct a series of workshops on the advantages of renewable energy and some of the dangers of nuclear power. Um, the argument that state legislators are making that solar, that um, Florida's too cloudy for solar is just absolutely ridiculous. I mean, we, um, it is too cloudy for utility scale solar, but when you decentralize your application of the technology on individual homes, it's totally viable. 